and then she started seizing me. And now she's not responding. Holy cow, they're all out there right now. They were running and screaming. You ready? I'm so nervous. I wait, don't know wait, what it wait, is. wait, hold a second. What do you see down here? Dirt. And on my prison. Dirt. Jumpsuit. Don't hurt. <laughs> did you make it out of the devil's pinch? I did. Did you make it out of the cave? I did. So will you we make can't it compare that? Will you make it out of this? I don't know. Who knows what can happen? What were you saying all last night and all this morning? What was I saying? You were going to cancel all this. Stuff. Yeah, I, <laughs> I did say that. I was like, maybe I should cancel. I don't know what it is. When I went in for breast cancer, it was a piece of cake. I was warrior. <laughs> this time around, not so much. I think I'm going to call and cancel. Way too nervous. Do you have the fear farts? And the bubble guts. We're here! And we had a riveting conversation on the way. So um, we were talking about cake toppers and how you can't find a dark man and an Egyptian woman for a cake topper if you get married. So what did you say you were going to use for me on a cake topper? I was going to use the Pillsbury Doughboy for you and Pocahontas for me. And I said, no, I'm going to find a little mummy for a <laughs> Halloween decoration. I'm going to put a little mummy right there. That's what I'm going to do. Can you just take me back home? No, you went into the wrong place. She went in the emergency room <laughs> instead of surgery. She's already trying to get us kicked out. I just dropped my last will and testament. Who'd you leave everything to? I guess you'll find out. Who's your executor of your estate? I guess you'll find out in that letter that I just dropped off. Who'd you mail it to? I guess you'll find oh out Oh my too. goodness, you gotta be kidding me. We in the right place this time? We should be. This is the main entrance, not emergency. We're on the ground level. Now we're heading up to the first floor. What's on the first floor? The main hospital slash surgery. Can't see your face. I dare you to show it. How about now? I think maybe yeah, we're definitely in the right place we're, this time. We're, we're here in the right place this time. Look at that surgery check out. Anything good on YouTube? Um, I'm looking at Zillow recommendations. For what? Uh, we're at. They just took George back for pre-op and probably in about 30 minutes they'll grab me and I get to go be with her before pre-op. Then, I'm gonna wait about three hours, maybe more. I got you hooked up on IVs already, huh? Mm -hmm. Set and ready to roll? Yeah. Okay, so basically, they're gonna do what? They're gonna take me in about half hour. 30 minutes. And then they're gonna put the sleepy time medicine through my IV along with uh, nausea medicine. They're also going to use a transderm patch for nausea because I am staying the night uh, for observation. I think that's what makes me nervous the most because out of all the procedures I've ever had, I've never had to stay the night. It's always been outpatient and this is the first time I'm staying inpatient. And you won't be able to talk for how many days? They're saying four days, four to five days. All right, so we we need to set up a communication system. So, all right, blank ones we're for just, yes. We're just going to text each other. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, we'll okay. be sitting next to each other, just texting each other. I think that's that's, that's what we're gonna best. do. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you don't want to use the blink system. The blink, blink system. If you want to use the blink system, blink once for yes and twice for no. I. S- is that SOS? SOS, save me, get me out of here. Send help. <laughs> Pretty sure that's what that was. SOS. What? What? What'd you say? <laughs> no, I want to know what you said. I said I may never make it out of the OR. Why not? Because my heart could stop. What's wrong with your heart? I have PVCs. You better not be giving me any PVCs. You're so ridiculous. Oh, I'm the ridiculous one? You're so ridiculous, you're redonkulous. She doesn't even have meds in her yet. She's already passing out just from the IV. (laughs) Oh my, oh my. I think they put sleepy sleep medicine in the IV. Not yet, not yet. (laughs) That's only saline water. No sleepy sleep stuff. My eyes, it made my eyes dry. You got your patch. Mm-hmm. Okay, so what's that gonna do? The patch, it's good for three days. It'll help me um, with nausea. But I'll get really dry mouth. Where's the incision gonna be? From here to here. It's gonna be a smiley face. Will it have to wear a mask too? Probably. Have you seen your remote, George? Mm-hmm. You can get water, toilet pain, or you can get a person that has a Wi-Fi signal coming out of their head. You getting Wi-Fi here? I'll take all of the above. May there always be sunshine. May there always be blue sky. Can you ask the nurse to give me something to help me relax? May there always be George. (laughs) May there always be Jeremy. George and Jeremy. Oh, okay. (laughs) I didn't... Okay, I see. That was the lyrics to the song. That was a lullaby to help you relax. You want something else? Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Hey... (laughs) Hey, 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 yeah. It's a pleasure to meet you, my dear. Nice to meet you. Okay, I'm just going to check you in and we're going to get the party started if you're okay with that. Okay. And what is Dr. Shin doing for you this morning? Tonsils? Not tonsils. <laughs> Thyroidectomy. Thyroidectomy. Okay, I already had my tonsils removed. We're not doing once is enough, my dear. Um, anything removable on you, such as contracts, dentures, or partials, loose or chipped teeth? No. Any jewelry anywhere? No. Any metal implants anywhere in your lower body? Mm-hmm. Good. Anesthesia has been in to talk to you? Mm-hmm. And Dr. Shin came in to say hello? Yes. All right. Any questions for us? I don't have any. Nope. Okay. So, okay. my name is Cheryl. I'm one of the nurse anesthetists. I'll actually be getting you to sleep, okay. staying with you, and waking you up. Okay. Any questions about anesthesia? Mm. No. I guess who's going to contact him then once I'm ready? When you're done, um, Dr. Shin okay, will call him after if you want, if it's okay for him to, for to talk to him. Yeah. And then um, they'll contact him from the uh, recovery room when they're ready. Okay. Yeah. So, let's see. I'm just going to walk ahead. Oh, sure. Yeah. Okay. And we're going to put this on your other arm. Okay. 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 I've got twice as much of that on my bathroom floor. <laughs> I thought you were going to say on your back. And I know, I did too. Where's it going with that? Are you untied in the back? Yeah. Okay. 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 All right, if you want to see you later, see you soon. <laughs> we're going to get moving on. <laughs> You're going to go out this way. Okay. You take the elevators. Yeah. All right. All right. Thank you, ladies. Sure. You're welcome. Mm-hmm.
What's it do? It really hurts to swallow. Yeah. If it hurts to swallow, try not to. Do you have to use the bathroom? You what? You just went. Where did you go? On myself. On yourself? Are you sure? What's Lefty doing? George, what's Lefty doing? Hmm. What? Where's Lefty? You okay? It hurts. It hurts. All right, slow this time. Slow. Did it hurt as bad that time swallowing? Blink once for yes, twice for no. Or don't blink if you're still. You want more water? Your eyes were just open. Can you open your eyes again? They're heavy. You, you're working on YouTube, right? You just came out of it and working on YouTube. She's officially awake. Are you still awake? Let me see them big brown eyes. You awake? She's a... She's officially, she is thinking about one thing and one thing only, food. This woman get hangry. So she's going to text me what she wants from the cafeteria because she can't talk. And we'll see how she's doing. Do you want to see what I brought you for food? Here, check this out. Here, I have something for you. Here you go, try that. And then I have something else for you. What do you got there? Mm -hmm. um, while you're recovering, if you need anything, push this button. Okay. And? <laughs> oh. Better open it. That's it. Oops, that was a demand an enema button. <laughs> and I know how you love pushing to the left and to the right. So I got you something that could be to the left and the right. How's that? Instead of coin pushing, you can Twix push. You can choose left or right. George is in room 248 right across the hall right now. They're losing somebody. 247, they're calling for rapid response. Everybody's running around like crazy. I didn't record most of that. A little rough, but nobody's guaranteed another day. Yeah, probably. I'll make sure you know where you're gonna go. Somebody named Eleanor. So, Eleanor. They're, they're calling for Eleanor, George. I'm pretty sure they lost Eleanor. They're across the hall trying to get Eleanor back. They can't get her to respond yet. Did you hear all that? Yeah? They're still trying to get her to respond. I'm sure the microphone isn't picking it up. They're trying to get her to do anything. You hear the you hear the flat line now? Yeah. Okay, nurses actually just ran into here. Did you see the nurse run in here and grab that? They're right across the hall. Okay, they said she started seizing. They're all outside of her room right now. Huh?
they just said she was getting ready to go home. And then she started seizing. And now she's not responding. Holy cow, they're all out there right now. They were running and screaming. She was supposed to go home. That's, that's how fast life is. Don't take it for granted and make sure you know what you're living for. What'd you say that's called? Crash cart. George says this is the crash cart when somebody code blues when they're losing them. Oh man, people are still going crazy. This is this is the cart they bring in when they're gonna lose somebody. And it's crazy out there. There's people crying out there, there's people vomiting. And then you have George in so much pain. You still drugged up? Cause you're talking crazy stuff. What were you just saying? I saw you being. You what? My teeth hurt. My mouth hurts. Your my teeth hurt? Hurts. Your mouth hurts. Your throat hurts. You were saying something about living the best life? I thought I am still living the best life. Living my dad's dream. <laughs> living your dad's dream working for me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Anything else you want to say while you're up on drugs? My roommate's my bond. She was so loud. Your roommate was extremely loud. And so needy. And obnoxious. Did it remind you of me? No. <laughs> <laughs> you're worse. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Nobody will ever be able to see those incisions. What do you remember? I remember the two nurses wheeling me down to the OR. Yeah. And then I had to transfer from my bed to a really, really narrow bed. Do you remember kissing me in front of them? Yes. You do? Through our masks. Yeah, so it wasn't a real kiss. It was just a mask kiss. Twice. Yeah, there were two. And then what happened? And then she put a party hat on me. Do I still have my party hat? No, your party hat is gone. And she made a comment that I had a lot of hair. And I told her I had twice as much of that in my bathroom at my house. Because you shed. You remember that? I thought you said you had twice as much hair on your back. No, that's what she said. She said, I thought you were going to tell me you have twice as much on your back. <laughs> mm. Tell you, let me just wax it. Yeah, and then you were telling her how you want to wax my back. Mm. So you do you remember anything at all? So then I felt a warm, tingly feeling in my IV. Your IV is still in. And that's probably when she put the sleepy sleep time medicine in it. Yeah. Usually they make you count backwards starting from 10. I didn't even have to do that. I was out. That's because you don't know how to count. Oh, yeah. True that. Or read. <laughs> <laughs> By the That's way, that those are our inside jokes for all the people who just got offended by me saying that. She says the same thing to me. There are inside jokes. That's all I remember. Mm. That's not a bad memory. Mm -hmm. So they took your thyroid, but you still have some memory, so that's a good sign. For now. Who am I? What's your name again? Who am I? What's my name? What are you doing here? Beats me. You mean, what the hells am I doing here? I have your calcium. Did they say if you're gonna need to take them at home? Calcium? So here they use these, uh, they're really, really big. And a lot of people think they are very hard to swallow. So you can buy this one. You can buy like, um, they're like over the counter, they're called calcita or something like that, but they look like chocolate. They come in like caramel flavor or you can get them in dark chocolate, but you can eat them just like candy instead of eating, like using this one. Most That'd be dangerous, like... I'd eat the whole bag <laughs> one sitting. Yeah, a lot, of, a lot of people don't like this. 
about what you can't do. Yes, you can do those. Usually those we usually say don't take those unless like if you feel like tingling around your mouth, that's the sign that your calcium is really low. So that's when we suggest you take the calcium because your body absorbs it much faster. Mm -hmm. But for every day they suggest taking those calcium. Okay. I take tons. Oh you I take tons all the time? Okay. Yeah, that's what I Oh well see you are you should be covered then. Just like this one today I play as really there. So a lot of people would like to have like taking them. They will probably be going home tomorrow, usually whatever time you want. They usually start that discharge is here as early as 7.30. Mm -hmm. Do you need anything else? What's your pain right now? Seven. I guess, um, Would you like something for pain? You have Tylenol. One plus one. Okay. And two. Three. Four. Five. About five thirty, I think. Not very good. You can eat your meal with it. Get hydrocodone about six or so that's a little bit stronger. You can get that with six. Okay, so I'll bring the knock away six of us. Oh, you know she's feeling better now. What are you doing? Scouring the internet auctions. <laughs> and you know it. You know I'm addicted when I'm looking at auctions. Back to business. <laughs>